Welcome to Floaty Creations. I can't see. Hi, I'm here. Floaty Creations. I put a base down, but I'm like, I don't know if it's... I decided to try a swipe similar to Molly's, but I did it all wrong. Was it paints too thick? My cell activator wasn't thin enough? I don't know. So I decided to wreck it and see how that comes out, but that didn't work either. Then there's that time when you thought you had the camera on, but you didn't. So I did blow this out, didn't like it, so now we're going to do a straight pour over it. put a lot of white on top because I didn't really have a base there. I should have just poured a little base and did that, but hey. Also didn't realize I was so unlevel until it was too late. I really like the way this came out, but at the bottom, I didn't like the way the gray, purpley thing was stretching, so I wanted to adjust that. Now, if you look at this now, it will look different when it's dry because it did move a little in the drying. As you see here, I'm swiping underneath there to get the drips, 
So it doesn't move, but it still moved. Look at those colors, wow. Um, there must have been some Australian Floetrol in there because you see those cells, I'm not sure what's in the white, but I still love it. Looks like there's a creature down there, kind of cool. And now the dry results. You can see we kind of lost that yellow-orange on the top left, but most of it stayed the same. It looks really pretty. Thank you for watching Flo D Creations at Work. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can find me on Facebook and Instagram. Have a fantabulous day.